Hi, I am DB. This is Anya Taylor Joy from Emma, and I'm here to answer your fan questions. I think I'm similar to Emma in the sense that I really want what's best for everybody that I love. Um, and sometimes my my opinion really comes into that. And I'm like, this is how you need to take care of yourself. Um, but the lesson from that is you have to let people make their own mistakes and just set back and um, just support them through all of that. At a pivotal moment, Emma gets a nosebleed and uh, I actually managed to have a nosebleed on cue, which was really weird and interesting, but um, it's probably the proudest acting moment I've ever had, but I have no idea how it happened. The clothes were a big part of me getting into character for Emma. Um, I'd never done clothes acting before, but it's a thing. And uh, our wonderful costume designer, Alexandra Byrne, um, she really showed me how to do it. So it helped me in, st me in staging a lot of the scenes, because if I was wearing a, a coat with a really incredible back, all of a sudden, you know, I'm acting kind of like this, just so you can see all of it. Um, so that was a really big part of it for me. They're actually a very true interpretation of the book, because the book is really funny and it's really witty. And sometimes with period dramas, people kind of feel a bit shut in and like they can't be real human beings and we are definitely human beings we just happen to be wearing corsets as a kid like the movies that made me want to be an actor were movies that had animals in them like free willy or jumanji and if i could go back and like act with an orca that would be kind of amazing thank you so much for hanging out with me i'm so proud of this film and genuinely everybody that made it is lovely so your support would be very appreciated uh emma comes out this weekend so thanks again